Um, today I'm going to say something uh, the kids have been telling me that I don't talk enough if I'm going to put things on YouTube. Today me and Seth are drilling some um, canyon spring oats. Uh, it's quite a hilly field over near Acklam. Uh, Seth is keeping an eye on things, making sure things are going alright. Uh, it's going well, it was been a bit of a damp day, so I didn't get a very early start, and um, so I shouldn't be too late finishing, but uh, unfortunately it won't, be, um, it won't be as early as I'd like, because it's Friday night. Uh, thankfully we've got guidance today, because it's quite difficult to see where you've been when you're direct drilling. Um, you probably can, you can see there actually, but in certain lights it's really quite difficult and if you're concentrating all day it's quite hard. Uh, it's going quite well, there is a steep patch back over there somewhere where it was just struggling to grip a little bit, but we always we got up anyway, so doing alright. Uh, we're also, this field isn't organic and with that machine there stuck to the side of the drill I'm just putting a little bit of fertiliser on. DAP. Uh, it's really supposed to put slug pellets on, but I had a little bit of DAP spare, so we're putting that on. Uh, we're tram lining at 24 metres, so that's one in every eight runs, and we're leaving some marks for the sprayer and the fertiliser spread to follow. Uh, other than that, I think it's going, um, going okay, hopefully. Like I say, just a little bit wetter than I'd liked. Uh, and a little bit later than we wanted, but it, it keeps drizzling and it just makes the surface of the soil a bit sticky. I will uh, try and film this while I turn round, if I can, if I can do it while I'm holding the camera. I won't be able to do it, I've been doing it all day. So we're coming to the end of the field now. So when we get to the end, we will lift the drill coulters out. Stay around. This filming will probably be absolutely awful. Anyway, here's the back of the drill. Should be able to just see our fresh mark here. Luckily, the guidance will also pick it up. That's found it. Put the drill back in the ground. Push this little lever forward and that'll get us back up to drilling speed. Uh, we're drilling at 8 kilometres an hour. Uh, to be fair, the tractor would pull it a lot faster than this, but I think part of the idea of direct drilling is not to disturb the soil too much uh, and then try and not to make any more weeds germinate. Whether that's right or not, I don't know. But if you go too fast, the disc tends to throw soil all over the place and uh, it probably doesn't bury the seed as well either. This field has got an absolutely fantastic view. One of the best fields to work in. Um, if there is any bad weather coming as well, you can certainly see it coming where the direction is coming from. Anyway, I'll look at this video when I get home, and if my voice isn't annoying, isn't too annoying, I will, uh, I'm going to post it. Okay, thank you. Can you say goodbye, Seth? Yeah, he says less than me. Bye.